If you boys are looking to pick up some FIFA 16 coins, head on over to Golda.com and use DRG for a discount. If you're looking to pick up some cheap MSP, PSN codes or cheap games, head on over to G2A.com. All links down below. What's going on boys and welcome back to something that I don't really do that often because, you know, trading and making coins isn't really my thing. But, I found one that's extremely simple that even I can do it. And that means you can do it. If I can do something that's to do with trading, anybody can bloody do it, even a bloody child. I'm that bad at trading and making coins. It's pretty unbelievable. So I'm going to share what I found with you. A lot of you will know it, of course, I know that. But there's a lot of people out there like me that don't really get it. But before we jump into it, boys, don't forget to jump over to my new fan family vlogging channel. We're about to hit two and a half thousand subscribers, which is pretty incredible. And when we hit 3,000, we're going to do another challenge video over there. So there's a link to it down below. Go check it out and subscribe if you're into daily vlogs. Now, back to this. So what you're going to do is, and now it's not a, it's not a way to make massive amount of coins, but if you get in now and do what I'm going to tell you early, you're going to make a decent profit once Team of the Season is over. That's what it's all about. Now that Team of the Season's on, people are selling things off to get more coins and reinvest into packs and stuff like that. So if you come into the consumables and if you go over to... Oh, I've got a bit, get a bit of gas stuck in my throat. You want to go to fitness. Then you want to set your max price at around... It depends. Set it for 700 and of course you want to set the quality to gold. Then what you're going to do is you're going to go in and you're going to search and then you're going to look for the the rare fitness cards, the ones that you know, the ones that everybody wants. So there's one there now, I'll just skip past it. So if you can get that for 700 coins at night time, I've noticed late at night you can get them for 600 to 650. I'll probably win that for 700 coins. And the reason you buy them now for 700 is because when team of the season's over and everything settles down, these squad fitness go for 11 to 1200 coins. So you're making decent profit. You can make four, five, 600 coins profit per every one of these that you buy. So it doesn't sound a lot, but if you buy 10, you're getting 4K profit and so on and so forth. So that's the quite simple tip I've decided to share. I think we're going to pick this up for 700 coins, bang, there you go, profit made. Now, as I say, it's an investment. You're not gonna make your coins back now, but when Team of the Season finishes, you can reload, if you buy 100 of these, and then relist them all up for 1,000 coins, you're definitely gonna sell them for 1,000 coins, possibly 1,100 once Team of the Season's over. You're making decent profit, especially, as I say, you can pick them up for 600 to 650 late at night. So. I know it's a short video, boys, but it's something I wanted to share. And if there are tips, trading tips that you boys have. Now, I know you can do this with players, but you need to have the knowledge of player prices. Because players' prices have crashed, but I never know where the player prices completely come back up again. So I'm not going to share a tip on a player that might not even rise back up in price. But with squad fitness, you can pretty much 100% guarantee they will go back up to where they were before Team of the Season started. So I hope you've enjoyed this, lads. If you have, smash a like, it really would mean a lot. Subscribe, of course, if you're new to the channel. And hopefully, I've made you a few thousand coins once Team of the Season finishes. Thanks a lot, boys. I'll talk to you all soon. Cheerio.